Hey, this is Lewis for Breakdance, and I want to give you one more reason Breakdance is better than Elementor. That is our lost password form element. So when user forgets their password, what do they do? Well, in Breakdance, you can add a forgot password form element to your page, and then you can totally customize this page. You could add, for example, a form here that says, oh, need further help, contact us, don't know your email address, click this button, whatever. Or just display the forgot password form and customize it so it looks good. In Elementor, there is no forgot password form. There is no lost password form. So there are two ways in Elementor that you could do this. Actually, more than two, but I'll talk about two in this video. One, you can use any number of add-on packs. Crago block, Jet blocks includes a reset password form element. You just enable it, and then you'd add it to your page. Um, Ocean WP has a lost password form. There are a number of other add-on packs that include a lost password form. You buy them, install them on your site, and then you'd see you know, forgot password or lost password. Right now, it's just, it's not there. Um, funny enough, there is a login form in Elementor. There's just no way to customize that lost your password page with an element. Uh, you can also use Actions Pack in Elementor. And basically what that does is a third-party add-on that lets you add actions to the default Elementor form element. And then you'd create a form, add the fields you want for resetting your password, and then choose the reset password action, which isn't included with Elementor. That comes from this actions pack thing. Or you could just use Breakdance, not think about any of that. Just go to the ad panel, find forgot password, and drag it into your page. That's three seconds versus potentially 30 minutes or three hours.